everyone. I am here with a collective haul and I know that I, it's like literally been a while since I filmed one of these and I know you guys miss them. I miss doing them too. I've just said this a million times but basically I just don't get that much stuff anymore just because like, you know, Red Velvet is currently not doing anything and it seems like they're not going to be doing anything for another while and I am going to say this now but like I filmed a collective haul clip and then my SD card was getting full and then I formatted it so if y'all don't know what that means it basically means that I cleared off my SD card oh I didn't realize my phone was on and I lost that footage and <laughs> I'm so annoyed because I had gotten like a number of things but I think I'm gonna go ahead and like compensate by trying to open some PO box mail and then also show you guys like everything that I did open so that like you guys feel like you're not missing out on anything. Um, for those of y'all who don't know, I usually open PO box mail on my live streams and I do feel bad because you know, I feel like not everybody who sends me mail tunes into my live streams and like the fun of sending somebody mail obviously is like getting to see them open it. So if any of y'all like want me to open it on camera like in a video, um, make sure you say so on the envelope like before I even open it so I know not to open it like during one of my lives because otherwise I usually will open it during my live. I'll usually try to see if like the person is there in my live but I have gotten a few letters from people who like don't usually tune into those or at least don't say anything so I never know if they're there so thank you guys so much anyone who wants to send me PO Box mail like I obviously am super grateful and I've been trying to send something back to everybody who is sending me a letter and for those of y'all who watch my life, you know what I'm talking about, but for those of y'all who don't, you're going to be getting a surprise in your mailbox. I'm kind of behind on sending them out, but anyways, I think I'm going to go ahead and just recap really quick what I've been getting in the mail or at least like what I got in my last package. Um, also, some of these are open, and it's because I've opened them on my lives, but usually put them back in, but you know what? We're gonna act like they're not open, and I'm gonna pretend that I've never seen them before, and the actress in me is going to come out, so. What can I show that I've already gotten? Okay, so, I guess first things first is I got Jessica's book, because y'all know Jessica is my girly, she is um, my bias, you know, in SNSD. I bought this because I was supposed to get like a signed book plate with it from an event, and I never got the book plate. So, honestly, not gonna lie, I'm too lazy to even contact them about it. I don't really, like, care enough. Like, it would have been nice to have a signed book plate, but I'm not gonna have a whole tantrum over it, so. It's just a regular old book. I have not touched her. I am not a reader. I bought this to support my girly. Um, let's see. I also got this really cute globe. I know this is so random, but it was, like, a part of their sixth anniversary goods, and it's super cute because... It has all of their fruits in it. I know the lighting isn't, yes, that's like significantly better, but there's this, it's super freaking cute. I did like a little group order with just me and my friends and we all ordered from SM Town and Store. And literally, I remember the night that these came out were a nightmare because everybody wanted this and it kept selling out. And then when it would go back in stock, I would contact like a Korean seller if they could buy it for me. And then it would always like, be sold out by the time they saw the message and they were ready to buy it and then so I was like fuck it let's just pay for shipping like to us and then so I bought it and shipping honestly wasn't that bad and there should be like some things in here that I got from trades yes okay so um I got this from a trade I traded my Wano version 2 PC for this one I'm just digging in my thing of cards and this isn't like a month's worth of cards this is literally like the past few months just because i've been waiting for um, my other cards to get here before i do reorganizing video um those are black pink cards i did oh those are leah cards but um i actually just pulled these from my group order and then here's an asha card um, I traded that an Aiden one for that one. This is a Trolls DVD card, which is so stupid because it's the same as like the movie theater one, but I decided to buy it anyway. I believe this was from a trade. Um, and I think that's it. And speaking of Blackpink CD, let's just go ahead and like open this. I've opened it already, but um, like I said, I'm trying to compensate for not having footage. So we're gonna go ahead and open this. I'm opening it from this side, it's already open on the other side, but for, you know, the theater and for the dramatic effects, we would go ahead and open it from this side. So, so, 
I have the Blackpink CD here. Now, if you bought four CDs, you either got all four member signatures or you either got four of the same member. Um, which obviously, oh shit, I didn't mean to hit the camera, but she now obviously freaking sucks. We were one of the lucky ones. <laughs> and we got all different signatures, which I'm so grateful for. That's why I bought four, that's why I wanted four. Um, it's just kind of annoying because I'm gonna have to display like all four CDs if I wanted to show every member's signature. But yeah, I'm super freaking shy chat. And then next, let's just go ahead and do the PO box stuff. So, oh my god, see, look at how freaking pretty this one is. This oh my god, this one's hollow too. Maybe I could like lower. There we go, that's a little bit better. This is so freaking pretty. Um, like I said, I did already open these, but it says, Hey Randy, I haven't been watching your channel for a while, um, but I have not stopped. I bought this to trade for you and I'm forgetting I joined a group order for her. I asked in a live if you had sub K because I forgot this is with the drama. I'm not sure if you have this, but if you do, feel free to trade or sell. I remember when I opened this, like, I don't sound super excited now, um, but I was like freaking out in my life. Thank you so much. Oh, actually, it's Shelby. Sorry. The return address thing was different. Shelby, thank you so much. You didn't have to. I was like super stoked when I saw this because I joined a group order for this and the group order manager is crickets on like sending anything out. So I haven't gotten it. You beat the group order manager to it. So thank you so much. This is so sweet. Um, usually I don't expect people to like send me cards, let alone official cards, you know? Like, I'm perfectly fine receiving just a letter, just so y'all know. You don't have to send me, like, or anything, like, of value because I, you know, will be super grateful if you send me a letter. But this is so freaking cute, and I don't have this card yet. I'm so excited. I'm not even sure if I'm going to get it in the group order, so, like, I'm super grateful that you sent this to me. Okay, next we have this one. Oh, actually, there's a freebie pack that I missed and not one. And I got this Joy RBB photo, and then this Day 2 one. Next we have this one, um, and it says Stein Shaw. Okay, and this, oh yeah, yeah, this one is from Maria, and Maria like decorated the envelope like so cute. I would show y'all here. Y'all can have a little sneak peek. <laughs> It's so cute, but this was like a purchase from Maria, and it says, Hey, baby, hope Thotty Irene arrives safely home. Also, silky, lol. <laughs> Thanks for joining. So, Maria held like a little group order. She bought like a set of the monster cards, and I bought two cards from her because I wanted to secure this Irene, which I ended up pulling anyway. But I also got this silky, which I think is such a freaking bad bitch card. This is like the only card I'm missing from my monster set, I'm pretty sure. So we have those two, and then we also have like this super cute freebie, which honestly like feels like a legit photo card, and it even has like all the specs and everything, so sorry Maria. Oh, I was gonna say I don't think I opened, but I did. Um, I remember I opened this with the person on my live, but they sent me this really cute Wano photo, and then this Joy drawing, which is like a star, she's kind of giving me like rat's tease. But it says, I wanted to send you fan art for your honest feedback. I need someone other than my art teacher to tell me my art sucks. <laughs> Congrats on 14K. Not gonna lie, I'm super picky with art, but I also can't draw for shit. Like I can't even draw like a round circle, so I really am in no position to critique your art and like Rainbow Dress Joy, like there's really no way that I'm not gonna like it, so. And then we have this, um, which I remember, this was like really cute. Somebody like was making a bunch of cards for themselves and they decided to send me some because they made too many and they're freaking cute as hell, like serve. Like I was seeing the strawberry one, like I might have to cut this and use this as placeholders for my sappy page. Um, but then they also sent me this and it says I got this freebie a really long time. Oh yeah, yeah, I remember. This was like the funniest thing ever. Um, <laughs> so they sent me a bunch of stickers, which I won't go through right now, Just, but it's so funny because there's these two. Sorry, I'm not like in the center. And then there's this one, <laughs> which was like, I watched this video before, it's like where somebody was doing like a makeup tutorial for Joy, and obviously it's not her. <laughs> I just think it's so funny that somebody printed that out and was like, yep, yeah, this is Joy's, so. Yeah, I probably would do that with a boy group too, so I'm not even, like, clowning 
that person who did it. I just think it's so freaking funny. And then we have this, which I don't think I've actually opened, but hello. I don't know why I keep going up, up I was about to say up here. Um, I keep going up there, sorry. This is from Gabriel Earth. So the return address says, let's see. Gabriel wasn't in any of my lives, so I was like, uh, maybe I should hold off and see if like they're gonna join one of my lives. But this says thank you. It has this cute flower design on it. Okay, let's see. Oh my god, I freaking love when people send me Polaroids so much, and I've said this like a million times. But it says, OMG, hi Randy, sorry this isn't the most aesthetic or cute card, but I just wanted to send you Polaroids of some of your face. You possibly might not know me, but I enjoy all of your videos and your lives. You are so funny and relatable. You radiate king energy, and we stand. Anyways, thank you for being you and being so entertaining. Congrats on all your success with your channel. Because of you, I started paying more attention to Red Velvet and they truly are and they are truly queens stay safe and healthy oh my god that is literally the sweetest card ever oh my god um, and then gabe um sorry I don't, I don't need to call you by your government name earlier but it says also you don't need to unbox this on a video or a live just do you um i appreciate that but it's too late <laughs> it's too late for that sorry they ain't that cute but i hope you like them oh my god literally no no, I am so happy whenever someone sends me anything, which I have to keep saying just because like I don't want y'all to think that like anything you send me is like garbage, you know, which it's not. <laughs> but this was like the sweetest card. I love getting cards like that. I've gotten like a lot of cards like that and it literally like, I don't know, just like never get used to hearing like, oh my god, like I love you so much and I watch your videos. It's just like crazy to me that 15k of y'all are out there just because like 15k is a lot you know like obviously in terms of like youtube it's not like a lot of like subscribers compared to other people maybe but like 15k people like are you freaking kidding me like in a room bitch like in a in a freaking concert like <laughs> That's a lot. Oh my god, I didn't realize it had like the sparkly effect. This is so cute. We have this Joy one. This Leah one, she looks so cute. Oh my god, my King Woozy. I've been wanting like a Woozy semicolon album so bad, but I'm waiting to see if anybody pulls him so I can just buy it off of them because I don't want to obviously like buy the album and not get Woozy because. I mean, I love Seventeen, but I'm not gonna lie, like, right now, she kind of is a solo stand for Woozy and Vernon. And when I say solo stand, I mean very loosely, like, I don't hate the other members, just to clear that out. Okay, next, we have this one. And I remember opening this, and I remember I said this was a white person's card. And this is actually a trade. But it says, thank you so much for trading, let me know when Rosé arrives. So I believe I traded, like, a duplicate Lisa card that I had. This is the last Rosé card that I need from the set, so I was more than happy to trade this person. The universe was telling me to collect Rosé, and I haven't decided if I want to. I probably am not going to still, but I had a duplicate, and I was only missing one card from her set. I was like, I literally might as well char we have this one and then we have this which is another trade which is actually like from one of my subscribers um okay yay this is cute oh my god for randy i feel bad because i just kind of threw mine in the top loader and was like here um so whenever y'all tell me like Sorry I got ugly packaging, like, no, I have ugly packaging, so, there is this, okay, let's see if I can, oh my god, now I feel bad, my package was so ugly, <laughs> okay, let's see, what, oh my god, okay, let's read the note first, um, hey Randy, I'm happy to be trading with you. I hope Rosie arrives safely and please let me know when she does. Also, just wanted to say I love your content so much. Don't ever change and stay safe. Oh my god, literally the sweetest. Ricardo is like always in my lives. Hasn't been watching me for like a long time, so I like appreciate you. Obviously, I appreciate like 
anybody who watches me for any length of time, but like the fact that people have stuck this long with me now and haven't gotten tired of me yet is like mind boggling to me. But we have this really cute rose postcard. I think I'm trying to collect her postcards. I really don't know yet. Um, I traded for this one because I had a duplicate Jisoo that they were looking for. And then we have this freebie pack. So. It has this black pink sticker, this rose sticker, which freaking okay, sir. And then, oh my god, no, you did not make these, did you? Yours too sweet. Okay, oh my god, this is so cute. We have this Joy Polaroid. Oh my god, are you really seeing this look on her? This honestly was like my favorite look from her and the music video. Oh my god, thank you so much, Ricardo. I freaking. Are you kidding me? Like, these are phone content, you know, like, putting the back of the phone. I don't, that wasn't even English. Y'all know what I mean. But, oh my god, thank you. Okay, next, we're down to these two. I already opened this one. We have this really freaking cute cat card. Um, and then, this is from Cameron, and it says, Hey Randy, I just want to say thank you for getting me into collecting. It's so fun and it makes me so happy. I love your videos and personality, so keep doing what you're doing. Also, congrats on hitting 14k, thank you! I remember seeing your finale group order when you had 8k and I was shocked you didn't have more because you deserve it, TBH. I don't know how to close this, so I hope you have a good day. <laughs> oh my god. Honestly, I'm just gonna put all of these in like a box, and when I'm having a bad day, I'm just gonna go through and read them. Just because, you know, I really Really don't deserve y'all but they gave me a bunch of these cute ass prints we have this itsy one this one they went to yara at the colonizer land and then we have this one <laughs> poor irene and yedem got cropped out this leah photo which is probably like one of my fave leah photos ever we have miss yedem sulgi Wendy Roche. I literally just got the Polaroid with this photo and I'm not mad at it at all. Sir, that's all I have to say is sir. Oh, there's a note back here. It says, um, these pics are stickers. Oh yeah, yeah, you did tell me that. And then we have this, which is from a subscriber, Vicky. Um, it's always like in my lives and stuff. I'm scared to find out what they sent me because they like weren't sure what to send me. And I was like, don't send me anything crazy. And they're like, okay, sure, I'll send you something crazy. Um, which I don't know if they did. Also, Vicky, if you're watching this, um, you probably have found out by now in a live that I've already opened your letter. So I'm sorry you're not like getting my live reaction, but. At least you're getting it in a video, you know? You get to rewatch this over and over again. So, let's see. What is in here? <laughs> I'm watching your live as I write this, so I decided to give you this Vernon Tour PC. There is literally no resale value, so don't try it. <laughs> Oh my god, I can't believe you would think that I would resell anything that a subscriber sent me. Even if I have duplicates, I'm keeping it. Um, a Monster X Polaroid thing, Wano is in it, and a Han Sungwoo postcard. It's because he looks sexy, and I know, you don't mind looking at sexy boys. <laughs> Oh my god, this person said, you are a full-time bot. Um, you should look into his music, or no, I don't care. I've been looking at the shipping rates for boxes for your box. I'm gonna send us looking around $20, so you should be expecting the package in the next few days. I'm kidding. Anyway, stay safe, and I remember to party hard. In this pandemic, love, good night. TBH, I hate how I package this stuff, but don't care enough to fix it. That's literally me. Love you long time. Victoria, I want a Randy PC. That is so funny. This letter, like, usually, you know, people send me letters on one page. And this felt like I was reading cue cards. <laughs> but, okay, let's see. Han Sung Woo, let's see. Oh my god, Vernon is so cute. What is this tape? Who is that? It says stay in playground. I'm assuming that's Stray Kids, because, you know, stay straight. Isn't there Phantom like stays, right? Yeah, you're you're a freaking stray kid stand. Stay with me, come on, like hello. I'm so sorry, Miss Stray Kids, that I have to hit you open like that. <laughs> okay, let's see how sexy Han Sung Woo is. Last. 
Um, but we have this Vernon PC. He's so freaking cute. Y'all don't know, Vernon is my second Pius. He basically is what like interested me in 17. Um, I saw Woozy and I was like, hold up. Wait. Are you freaking kidding me? Oh my god, they look so cute. And then this is Han Sungwoo. I'm assuming he's like a, a solo artist because it says first mini album and it just has his name on it, Fame. I can't even see his face, girl. What the fuck you mean? Is he sexy? <laughs> we'll, have to, we'll have to Google him later. But this like, package from my friend's Korean friend who like does me a favor all the time like orders me stuff which i'm super grateful for there we go so we have this precious moments key ring wallet i don't know what this is called but we have that and it comes with a little cute joy gem or whatever um and then it comes with that and then obviously the main thing why we bought this for or the main reason why we bought this was this card but look at how freaking cute this card is i feel like the exposure is like kind of all crap today oh i made it higher okay that's a lot better but honestly look at this ugly ass font like that's font what i would have used and like when i was in second grade using photoshop but regardless this is a freaking cute card okay. oh this is a big ass bag okay are. We got this postcard. The reason why I bought this was because I ordered the troll stuff, but by the time I was checking out, like this one was sent out. Both stuff is currently at my Korean address, being held hostage by Miss Paceable. And then we have this, which are like glow in the dark stickers. I don't know why I got like this bumpy texture on it. I don't know if y'all can see. Like, it's just the plastic, but I'm just concerned. Like, are you good? <laughs> But yeah, I don't have any intentions on using this. I just think the sticker set is so freaking cute. So we have those two things. And then last in this package, we have this. Okay, I know what you're thinking. What the hell? And what the hell is right? Um, it's because the sixth anniversary goods, like I said, were selling really quick. And my friend friend my friend's friend in korea was buying stuff and i was like you know what? i don't want to get nothing if i can't get the snow globes so i was like you know what? let me just go ahead and snatch this up because it's not like the ugliest thing ever i saw pictures of it and i thought it was really really cute but we have this it's so stupid and y'all can't even see what it says but it basically just says Red velvet flavored milk, which is a little weird. Um, but I don't know, do I actually put milk in this? Like, what am I supposed to actually do with this? And then it comes with this stick, which is like member specific. And we got, you know, obviously Miss Joy's. I'm assuming I'm supposed to like mix my milk with this or something. It's cute. Like this. <laughs> What's that one Korean YouTuber who like makes the drinks at the cafe on their vlogs? Like this is what I feel like. So let's open this Blackpink LP. Fun story time for those of y'all who like haven't watched any of my lives recently. Basically what happened was k for you fucked everybody over who ordered uh, LP. Not everybody because some people got their LP. But you either were in like the first batch or the second batch of like the LPs. And I was the lucky second batch winner. And basically everybody who got sent their LP out and the second batch received, are you ready for this? There, 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 there. Anyways, <laughs> received this. But I think looks different, right? She does. And I was super freaking annoyed because obviously the LPs are limited and how could y'all fuck something up like that, like that bad? Like multiple people were getting NCT's albums and everybody was pissed. Um, I got my refund from K-Town for you, but it's like one of those scenarios where it's like, I would so much rather get the item than the refund because like I got the LP for like $50 maybe at K-Town for you with the discount link. And when I bought it, it was like, over double the price for resale, and I was just never forgive K Town for you. So honestly, fuck K Town for you on the gang. Unless y'all want to sponsor me, then you know I love K Town for you. But anyways, I opened this in live with Ariel, but we got Mr. Ten, and then I also got Dan's black PC or whatever, and I traded Matt for 
Shitaros or whatever, the, one of the new members. Um, the only reason why I did that was because I don't really care who I get. I don't even stand NCT like that. So I was like, well, you know what? If I can trade somebody and like help them get their vibes and I don't care who I have, like, then so be it. Let's go ahead and open this. It's got here so quick. And I'm excited to see what number we get. Me thinking about how I should be doing homework right now, but instead I'm sitting here filming this damn video. <laughs> So I know some of y'all are sitting here watching this while y'all are supposed to be doing homework. And so, twins. <laughs> okay. Oh my God, he packaged this so well, our king. Oh my God. Oh my God, y'all can't see it, but it's like in between styrofoam, like come through, packaging king. Okay, let's see. It is stupid heavy, like insanely heavy. Oh my god. This is huge. I'm like a big vinyl collector and that's why like I absolutely needed to buy this. I just, like before I was collecting photo cards and fungal pops, like I used to buy vinyls religiously. Um, I kind of stopped now because, you know, obviously I'm collecting other stuff, but oh my god. <laughs> the weight of this is literal madness. <gasps> Oh my god. Oh my god, the box is like hollow too. Like a black hollow and it's so pretty. Okay. I feel kind of guilty opening this. Like I feel like I shouldn't be opening it right now. <laughs> okay, so this is the front. This is what, I know I'm gonna get my fingerprints all over this and I hate it, but this is the back. You can see like the track list. Not really, not on camera at least. But she's there, she's right here. But we have like the same lenticular cover as on like the album photo books. It's kind of boring, not gonna lie. I wish they gave us something more exciting, like at least a different image. I'm scared, what number are we gonna get? Sorry, I mean to hit the camera like that. Is this it? Is this gonna tell me what number I am? Oh no, this is like a signed like, oh, okay, we were number 5,000. That's kind of a cute number, not mad at it at all. And then we have these cute buttons. There, we have one of each of the girlies. There, y'all can see it better. And then this album one, I'm not super into buttons, um, so she will be staying in the packaging. <laughs> but then we use this ribbon to lift everything, I'm assuming. Oh, this is like a little folder. So, I know y'all have already seen this, but I haven't, so I'm just gonna sit here and enjoy me opening this. We have this. Oh my god, are we seeing the hollow on them? We have this one. Oh my god, they're sick. Oh my freaking god. Wait, what do the backs look like? Oh, okay, so the backs actually have like all of the lyrics on them. So many people were complaining about the photo shoot in my unboxing video. And I'm like, this is not YG customer service, please. Oh my god, they look so sick. I'm so sick of lying. You gotta know that. <gasps> what the hell is this? <gasps> Wait, we get transparent ones too? <gasps> oh my god, y'all can like barely see those, but I'm not moving the box, so I'm sorry. <laughs> oh my god. So when we lift this up, she's not staying. <laughs> Whoa. Are we seeing this? I don't know if y'all can, but, oh, it's like a bunch of different, it's a bunch of different books that fit together. Okay, so let's see what's in here. Let's see. We have these standees, which they're really cute, but I'm never gonna like stand them up. I don't have the guts to, so, but obviously we're just like, oh wait, they have backsides. Oh my god, Miss Roche, she's looking like a Tumblr girl. Okay, we have those. So we have that section, and let's see what this one is. This is, this is like sticky notes. <laughs> so we have the track list right here. Oh yeah, these are like the Polaroid photos or whatever. Like basically they turned the PCs into um, like, these so these are all like the pc photos but in the card form if that makes sense um oh what do the backs look like okay they just look like that oh my god they're so pretty now i can have like an ot4 set and not have to buy all of them 
originally, but like when I saw these two Lisa cards, I thought they were like the same just because her hand gesture is different. But I think I pulled this card, right? I think so, I can't remember. But serve. And then this is the photo book, I'm assuming. Or no, there's no photo book. It's just a bunch of these big ass cards. Am I supposed to tear these? I'm not tearing these. I don't have the guts to. <sighs> Oh my god. Are these like the postcard photos? It feels like it, right? <gasps> oh my god. Miss Jenny. Yeah, these are the postcard photos. Or at least some of them are, because I remember that one. And then we have this one. Let me just turn this. Um, Jenny. Wait, this photo looks so pretty. Her hair looks like rainbow at the top. Okay, she did it for the for the gauge. Um. Oh my god, they look so pretty. I still wish that they used like different photos though. Like, hello, y'all got these photos finally. I've been wanting to see these photos. Okay, Jenny. And I remember I got like a postcard with that please be pink oh i didn't mean to take out the ribbon like that so from what i know like this has like their whole discography on it but now that i'm seeing the track list all over it i'm not sure because i originally thought that's like why it was so expensive was because it has their entire track list and i guess not because it only has one <laughs> One LP in here. But this better be pink, I swear to God. If I open this shit and it's not pink, yep, she can go back. Look at how boring this is. Like, good night. She can go back in. Anyways. <laughs> we have this photo book, which, not gonna lie, I don't really have the energy to go through right now. I bet it's just like one of the other photo books in this big format. I bet. And then we have another photo book. Um, okay, they gave us two photo books. I wish they would have just given us like one big one. I don't get the point, but sure. Then we have this, another photo. We got four photo books? Wait. Oh my God. Okay, now I understand why they did four different photo books. I'll take it back. This one's the prettiest one, but it's also like the dirtiest one. Like it has all these cum scenes on it. Do y'all see it right here? Oh my God, and my fingerprints now. But now it has all of the colored photos in it. Okay, so I think this is going to be like the second and final clip of my collective haul. I have this box, but I also have like a bunch of like Trolls goods that I am not bringing into the shot. They're not in a box, um, so I don't have like the dramatic unboxing to do for you for those, but I will be showing you like all that stuff because it is just from my group order and like, you know, there's no point in me putting it in a box just for dramatic effect, even though that kind of sounds like something that I would do um, now that I'm seeing it. But anyways, this is a package that I got from somebody in Hong Kong. Now this stuff is from a proxy, it's from somebody on Instagram and um, there's like some stuff in here that's a little over six months old. Like I remember a long time ago sending them stuff to buy for me, but yeah, I won't lie. I basically forgot everything that was in here. So now we're gonna find out with me. Oh shit, I didn't mean to rip the box like that. <laughs> oh my god, cute! Okay, let's see what this note says. It says, thank you for buying. Hope it will arrive soon. And this is the app for anyone. They're super nice. Um, I don't have a, like issue promoing them, but um, basically I get a bunch of Chinese stuff from a site called Shanyu. It's like not a site, it's an app. And I basically just message live to die all the stuff that i want to buy and they will help me buy it and i feel like the fees usually are pretty reasonable don't have an issue with them at all oh my god and then we have this adorable joy sticker oh my god and these are all the stages from la rouge and they're so freaking cute we have the fan me outfit here too with hat nim but okay sorry i couldn't tell if it was in focus or not but let's see 
bizarre. Um, what is this? Oh, this must be the button. Okay. I'm literally half asleep. I don't know if you saw the way that um, I fumbled those scissors, but I just woke up from a nap because I had a throbbing headache today and I needed it so bad. And yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. It's a little bit out of the loop. Okay, so they had like, uh, I wanna say gotcha event in Korea a while ago, like obviously during Icy era, and her button happened to come with one of the cards that I bought. <sighs> oh my god, yay! Okay, so as you can see, there is these Silverine, but I don't remember what it was called. Like, it's not the with fans one. It's like the I honestly don't remember what site this was. It was like so something. I honestly am probably 1000% wrong, but anyways, so we have these cute cards and they're basically pre order benefits for a site in China. And I think they came with every single album like a set came with every single album so like don't be overpricing these cards or don't be buying them overpriced because like i said they came with every single album purchase so you know obviously there are so many in the world but they're so pretty that like i just could not not buy them um i really wish that we got photo cards of blonde irene and redheaded sulgi uh, the backs are blank which is pretty disappointing so i have these two and then I have this one for my friend Sage. And then we have this. We got Leah's Gotcha event Polaroid. Where's the opening? <laughs> so this is just a printed Polaroid. Ooh, okay, the, she kind of feels like a legit Polaroid. And then it just says it's the on the back, but it is a super cute photo. And then we have this. This is also from the Gotcha event. And it is just like a four by six photo. Yay, okay. So this is the photo. And then also the Solreen cards came with a sealed album as you can see right here. Don't need any cards, but let's see who we pulled anyway because I'm excited to see. Ugh, this is why I literally hate the album packaging. I don't know if y'all can see it, but like this dent right here that the see who we got. So for our grantee card, guarantee card, we got, ooh, okay, we got Irene. I feel like I've gotten so many solo ones, but not as many duet ones. Ooh, okay. I can see everything like right off the bat. So we got a unit PC. And then we got these two postcards. And then for the poster, we got Sylvie's poster. Then we have all of this troll stuff. Pulled all of the stuff from my group order, so it's not in a box. I'm sorry I can't like cut the top of the box and like open it all super satisfying, but I'm gonna give you ASMR instead. <laughs> this is all the stuff that I got. Now, you're gonna notice that I don't have any of the photo card sets, and that is because, long story short, um, I was short on the photo card sets, and I had to give up my own. Um, but I just ended up buying them, like, from somewhere else, so I do, like, have them secured. I just don't have them with me right now, which is, you know, obviously super annoying because I held a whole ass group order, hello, and I get to buy or whatever the items that I wanted to. Right, let's start with the elephant in the room, this big ass peekaboo cushion. Y'all know Joy is my girly, and y'all know that peekaboo is my favorite era, and honestly, like, I originally was not interested in any of these, but then, like, I saw how pretty, sorry, the colors were, and, like, hello, the colors are so, like, vibrant and freaking gorgeous, and this is what the back looks like. Okay, and then I got these pin sets. So, we have this Joy one, we have Silky, Wendy, and then Irene, and then this extra Wendy is actually for a friend, 
But you're gonna notice that I don't have Yeti and that's because I ordered a Yeti pin But somehow like I was short a Yeti pin so I had to give up my own So it looks like I'm an OT4 stand, but I'm not and then we have this super cute Jelly not jelly. This is like a candy key ring and basically let's just open this because I want to see <gasps> this is so cute okay you're not like actually supposed to open this but as you can see it has a bunch of fruit in it I like hello this is like the cutest concept ever okay next we'll do the pencil case which us to die for like is probably one of my favorite things in this whole merch line so I have like a bad boy pencil case right now, so she desperately needed an upgrade. <gasps> oh my god, the little zipper is a heart. Hello, attention to detail, come through. Um, and then this is what she looks like. Obviously, you know, you would just put your school supplies in here, your essentials, you know. Like this, you know. Don't fuck with me type of shit. <laughs> And then we have the masking tape, which um, I guess I will take out. I suppose it won't hurt to do it so. God, I literally hate autofocus so much. So in case y'all didn't catch like what each one looks like, this is what they look like. So then we have this sticker pack. Oh no, I... Whatever, I was gonna throw that away anyway. <laughs> okay, hoarder come through. This bitch said I wanted to keep it in the plastic bag. But, are you fucking kidding me? This is a joke. It's a scam loaf. Are we seeing this? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, at least the stickers are cute, question mark. Um, there's just a bunch of hollow stickers and you get like a total of maybe 10 stickers. Yay, woohoo. We have this card wallet, which is to die for. I think it's so cute. This is the back. I'm a sucker for like glittery stuff like that, but she's super cute. And then I think the second to last thing, actually no, I have a bunch of other stuff, but Next, we have this postcard, coloring postcard thing is what they're calling it. Okay. Oh my god, cute! Let me zoom out a little bit. So, we have this Irene one, and then on the back, it has, like, the actual outline of the thing that you can color, but my ass is not going to color them. <gasps> this one is so cute! Honestly, I think Joy's, like, or not Joy's, but... All of their summer magic designs are my favorite, like the, the ones with the cups. Like, oh my god, they're so precious. And then we have the Russian roulette outfits. Sorry, I'm not showing the box, but you can imagine what the box look like. So, you get a total of 10 postcards. These honestly just, I mean, they're meant to like feel like coloring paper, so like they just feel like paper. They're honestly nothing special. And then, we have this beach towel. I'm gonna be real with you, I'm not gonna be able to fit this on camera, so I'm not even gonna bother opening it. But, I'll post a picture of what it's supposed to look like, because it's super freaking cute. And then, last but not least, we have that sound like kind of broke my heart. <laughs> We have these bad boys, and they are the dolls, and yes, my dumbass decided that I wanted to get a full set, so let's go ahead and take off of the paper of all of these. <laughs> they look so freaking cute. I don't know if I'm going to be able to fit all of these in a shot. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> a 
Okay, so I know what you're thinking, like, why the hell did you need a full set of these? And the answer is that I didn't, but I was thinking, like, when I do get a legitimate shelf for all of my red velvet stuff, it would be super cute to display all of these in the boxes. Like, I don't think I'm going to display them out of the boxes. Um, just because, you know, like, as collectors, we just have to keep stuff in the box. But, not going to lie, I feel like Miss Yeti's hair right here, her hair needs to be sorted out. So, um, but let's go ahead and, like, open this one. And let's see if we can get her hair situated. Because, come on. <laughs> Oh my god, this is so freaking cute. Like, hello. This hair looks like shit. Pie come on, come on, ice cream cake. Da -da 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 -da. I was wanting dolls of these. Like, I was hoping for plushies. I kind of wish the plushies were bigger, but um, you know what? Fuck it. SM gave me a figure or a plushie or whatever you want to call it of it at the end of the day so I guess I can't sit here and complain and then as you can see Joyce is peekaboo, Wendy's is Miss Dum Dum, Sylvie's is Miss Zenzella Bin, and then Irene's is Red of Flavor which I think are like all pretty fitting eras for all of them but yeah I think that's it for my haul question mark I'm gonna go ahead and bring some things back. Okay, this is gonna be my ending shot. It is so underwhelming, but thank you guys so much for watching. And I feel like I said this in a video before, but thank you so much for 15K. I can't believe there's 15,000 of you who want to watch me and all that stuff. So I am absolutely honored. I can't wait to reach 20K because that is going to be another milestone that I never thought I would reach. <laughs> Before I keep talking, I have my ass. Thank you guys so much for watching. So, so much. And peace out.